The Indie Shorts International Film Festival kicks off tonight. And the festival returns for its seventh year of celebrating short films. Let's go live now to News 8's Renan Gutierrez. He is at the Living Room Theaters in the Bottle Works District this morning. Renan, good morning. Tell us all about night one, and I hear it features a lot of Hoosiers. Hey, good morning, guys. And yeah, that's right. Night one features Indiana Spotlight's programming. There's these two programmings, all filled with short films, either about Hoosiers or by Hoosiers. So speaking of which, we have Amelia. She directed The Invisible Crown. Good morning. Good morning. Thanks for being here. Tell us a little bit about what you got going on tonight. You have your film, uh, if I remember correctly, premiering. Tell us how exciting that is and uh, tell us a little bit about what you, what you worked on. Yeah, um, it is really exciting. So my film, The Invisible Crown, is premiering tonight. Um, and it is about um, Hannah Langrand and her journey with endometriosis. So and uh, Hannah has um, dealt with endometriosis for over half her life. And this film kind of picks up on her third surgery as she's preparing to go into that. Um, and it actually takes a creative approach in that we're not really focusing on the medical information necessarily. Um, but we really kind of go into her headspace and her emotions and feelings as she's preparing for her surgery. So without giving too much away, tell me a little bit more about the why, why you decided to do something like this. Yeah, so um, it was really important to Hannah and myself that this film really spreads empathy for those who are suffering with endometriosis and also to empower people um, to advocate for themselves, not only in the medical field, but also just in life. Um, it's really about finding peace in the unknown. And real quick, when can people catch your, your film? Um, it is actually premiering here today um, at the Living Room Theaters. It's sold out, but you can still get tickets um, on Sunday at Newfield at 145. All right, Amelia, thanks for being here this morning. We appreciate it. If you're still looking to catch tickets, they start at $12. Full access passes are still available to all of the festival. It runs through Sunday. Reporting downtown, I'm Hernan Gutierrez, first TV, wishtv.com, or follow us on Facebook for updates.